Hi everyone, this is Jennifer and I'm back today with a new layout for the HipKit Club Design Team. For this layout, I will be inspired by the mood board of the months. I will focus on the rays of the sun and the colors of the phrase. So, I start by coding a white cardstock with clear gesso. Once everything is dry, I'll use this ray of sunshine stencil I made with my Sweet Cameo, but if you have a real stencil, it's even better. So I put the stencil at the top right of my page and I apply the modeling path. I start with the center outwards and I don't go all the way to the end so as not to have a straight edge. I want the extremities to be, um, how I can say that, uh, uh, unstructured or disjointed. So I use Tim Holtz Distress Texture Past Mat. This is my favorite past the most. I remove the stencil gently and I dry everything well. I will add the inks now. I'm using Chimmer's Inklings Sun Kissed ink from the July 2021 color kit to start. I apply this ink to the pattern here and there in a random fashion without completely covering the pattern. Then I add the Chimmers Be Based Mustard Seed ink from a previous kit and I dilute the ink with a little water so that it can flow and spread. And I add the two inks alternately to create nuances and with a little water I blur the outline so that there is no demarcation. So I add the Chimmers Vibes Mango Tango ink to create pink orange shades and always with a little water I spread the inks so that they mix. I dry everything well to fix the colors and keep adding the same inks to intensify the colors and widen the areas. So I soften the edge of the inks with absorbent paper to have blurry or faded edges. I dry again and add more ink until I get the right shades for those sun rays. When the shades shoot me, I dry last time and I finish with splashes of white gesso diluted with water to bring light. So I continue with the inks. I spotted these die cuts leaves from the main kit, but there are only two. So I will create more with the exclusive July 2021 cut file tropical leaves. I cut them out of watercolor paper in two different sizes, um, 6 by 4 inch and uh, 5 by 3 inch approximately. I place them on absorbent paper and spray the inks directly onto the leaves in a random fashion to create shades. I use Chimmers Vibes Don't Rain on my parade and the colorings. Um, Jose, can you see inks? I dry everything well to fix the colors and I add the same inks again to intensify the colors and I dry again. 
the colors match the laked sleeves well. It's very easy and quick to do. I continue with the layout. I will place the elements to give me an overview. So I place the photo in the center as Q, then I add the word Puffy Stickers Sunny from the main kit and I add the leaves on each side. I add different die cuts, um, coconut cocktail, uh, the word summer, um, pineapples, Fridays, um, palm tree, a few more words and the favorite place and us puffy stickers. This is basically my layout. I just have to prepare my photo and glue them all. So for the photo, I add crumpled tracing paper underneath to add texture and blur the edges. I add a red pattern card from the Pocket Life kit to make the photo stand out from the layout and uh, another orange pattern card. I distract the edges of the cards before gluing them below the photo. So I repainted the photo uh, reversing the direction of the image uh, because I wanted our faces to face the rays uh, of the sun that I created. I then add cardboard underneath to add volume. So I glue the photo on the sun rays as Q so that the umbrellas in the photo are straight. And I can glue all the um, embellishments around the photo with 3D foam. I recut the white outlines of some die cuts like the leaves, pineapples and palm tree for a more harmonious look. And I distress the edges of each embellishment before gluing them. I chose this photo which reminds me of a wonderful memory. It was in July 2019 and we left between lovers for the first time since we have our children to celebrate our 10 years of marriage in Menorca. A truly incredible trip of a few days where we discovered a wild and truly superb Iceland. And I found this photo while looking for thermal photos and I immediately wanted to use it. I printed it in black and white so that it really pops off the page and you can see it right away. That's it for the little story. So let's come back to this page. I thus glue the leaves by three on each side of the word sunny, but before I distress the edges. I love doing this and I love the one side that it brings.
so I add I cut coconut cocktail and I complete the title of die cut summer that I glue directly on it. I love to focus title and glue multiple words uh, above or below. I also add the phrase Puffy Stickers um, favorite place below the title and it fits perfectly. I add the small pineapples on each side of the title and I glue the die cuts in the shape of a chat bubble on the photo on each side so that me and my husband each have our say. So I add a little word die cuts next to it. Something is missing from this layout and I spot the image of uh, the black and white rosette of the mood board. So I add black acetate uh, mandalas from the main kit. This is really what this layout needed. So I add a little die cut phrase under the title on the puffy stickers. And I add a few more die cuts here and there and I add just superb wood veneer phrases here and there too.
I splash white gesso diluted with a little water to harmonize everything. And finally, to finish, I add splashes of black paint diluted with a little water to bring a little pep and contrast. I hope this layout has you more and maybe will inspire you for a future project. I love the way everything came together very simply and I'm completely a fan uh, of that little tropical side that leaves brings. Thanks for stopping by and watching. I wish you a beautiful day full of creativity. See you soon.